Good morning, YouTube. What's up? Stevens LTD back with an almost daily. It's Monday. It's been snowing out. We're taking the big white Kenworth and we're going to go haul some corn today and we'll see what kind of fun we can get into. Almost daily, Monday. We are back and at her. Chugging some tires. Going to go haul some corn out of the big city of Thamesford. If you don't know where Thamesford is, it's just outside of London, Ontario. And then we'll take her to Elmer, where we went this weekend already. So, you know, that's a daily thing. It's not always I'm doing something different, but I know my video's seen that. I'm always doing something different, but now you can kind of see that. I'll do the same thing for a couple days, and then we'll switch her up. All right, all the air and tires are good. Oil's good, cooling's good. Everything's good, lights are good. Let's head her down the road. Well. My seat is already hot, so I cannot complain there. And we are ready to roll. Spreading the salt out thick here this morning. Keep her going, buddy. Get us some more loads, 10-4. And we're coming up to the Putnam Bridge here. So maybe you can kind of see what a truck looks like going through it in size comparison. I don't know if this guy will go through it or not, but hopefully. Myself just fit. Beauty. Hammer down. All our trucks fit. All our trailers fit except for the. Oh, thanks, buddy. Except for the walking floors. They surely don't fit unless you hit it hard enough. Gotta get used to driving this truck. Alright, Thamesford bound. Well, we got her scaled in. Here we are in Thamesford. The big old elevator right in the middle of a subdivision and they are building and building and building more and more and more. So, so sooner and sooner to this place being torn out of here. They've taken out buildings on the other side. They're taking out these buildings. They're, yeah. Matter of time, clock's ticking. So either I'm getting loaded straight through there or I gotta go down the alleyway there. So I was kind of wait for someone to come out here. Apparently a little early for my appointment. So I might be taking her back to the yard actually for a bit. And then heading her in. And then doing the second one. But we will see. So if I do got to go down the alleyway, I'll have to back back up. And then hook her around real wide. But maybe we'll be going this way. We'll see. Either way, this place can get real dusty if you're not facing the right way. But geez, dirty winter, and it doesn't really matter. And we are backing up. Oh, if I can, I might have to go straight. Nope, we got her. We got her. Perfect. I was getting stuck there for sure. Someday I'll do a video on how to back these things up. It's not too hard once you get her figured out. Yeah, that should be plenty far back to take her wide, Clyde. Forward we go. Nice big wide swing in here. And 
she falls out. That little sock right there. Oh, sorry about the brightness there. Damn snow, getting tired of it. There, that's what we're actually looking like. Snow is too frigging bright for the camera to be working out as well. All right, I'm gonna go roll them tarps open and we'll put some weight in the box and kick her down the road. All right, looks like we got the green light fixed. Don't literally move me up uh, half an inch. <laughs> okay, okay. Are good to go. I'm sure you're thinking, yellow, isn't that back up, Shane? But they gave me the red, green, red, green, yellow. So that means get going to the scale. Very nice plowed out snow here. Very well done. Excellent job all around, really. So this scale here in front of us was relocated. And when they first relocated it, it kind of just dropped off right there. Like it was just a straight down and it was just the worst. So technically you're not supposed to go at it the way I'm going. It says don't, but I'm going to because I don't really like having to climb up the big hill onto the scale with the full load here. I'd rather just hook her around and drop back down the other side. 10-4. And that's all the new townhouses and stuff they're building way out there. That'll all be up and in this field here in a couple years. And then here's where it says one way, do not enter. But I will be going on this one way and it's this way. And then all those new houses they're putting in will eventually go down the river right there and be worth lots and lots of money. All the new handrail kind of ruins the thumbnail. Ooh, need a couple lights on there, 10 four. We got the paperwork and down the mountain we go. So yeah, before it, like you were back on ground level before those black boxes, it was just a straight drop down. <laughs> like, I don't know why they thought that would work or why they use this as the location. Downhill, straight to a turn, but. I don't run the show around here, so not my pig, not my farm. Had a silo collapse there a couple years ago. Ripped out a lot of the roof for that big dry silo. Well, Tensford, it's been fun. And maybe we'll be back here again today. I don't know. We're gonna go down nice, slow, and steady. 
a little early for the appointment time, but oh well, there's no point in dragging it all the way back to the yard just to work for an hour or a half hour and then get back in and go. Might as well just head her down that way and see what they say. Might not let me in, maybe they will, who knows. Either way, we are on route. That's what I mean by it's like right in the middle of a subdivision. nice when you get this one green but it's not often Definitely won't be able to see across the field today to see what the lineup's like. Not that it really matters anyway, we're so early. I'm gonna have to take the long loop around and pull over on the side of the road and do some waiting. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can see that it's empty, so that sucks, because I wish I could just boogie it right in there, but don't need anybody getting upset, so. We'll do her the proper way, just roll her straight through here and around the big large car alley here in Elmer. Oh yeah, Elmer is snow covered roads, so big large car up there at the corner. I think I might just wait for it to go yellow. Yeah, there's no way I'm getting through there. Thanks Russell Metals for getting in the way of the large cars. more back there I don't know what that is hiding behind them trailers but damn and here we sit and wait until it's our time to go in well everybody we pulled up here about an hour ago now I've actually edited most of the video and we are an hour from our appointment time so I'm gonna ask them here in a sec if I can come in, if they need me to wait a little bit longer, trying to be respectful, they come here a lot and I don't want to get anybody mad. So, we came here twice on the weekend with the 2W9, so if you want to see me going on load, which I can't really show you anyway, you should go back and check out that video. But I'm going to end this one here because there's not much point, can't really show you anything. The sooner I get this done, the sooner it gets uploaded and the sooner you get to see it. Let me know what you thought about this one. So that's where the loads that we took this weekend came from and that's how it's done. Make sure you guys leave a like on the video, leave me a comment, let me know what you think. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, you definitely should. Alright guys, I appreciate you watching. As always, we will see you tomorrow.